Disney has so many stories that there are literally thousands of characters. And since it's underrated week, I'm gonna share with you who I think are the top 10 most underrated Disney characters out there. First up is my favorite Disney duo, Flotsam and Jetsam from The Little Mermaid. They're super creepy, definitely evil. Ursula needs them to go spy on Ariel and they do a really great job of doing that. They're practically the only villain sidekicks that do what they're supposed to be doing. I love them, underrated. My next favorite is Skippy from Robin Hood. Ah, uh, sorry Judy Hopps, this is the cutest rabbit in the Disney universe. Skippy is so sweet, he like makes my teeth hurt. I love him so much. And he's kind of the epitome of what it means to be in Nottingham. He gets his birthday money stolen from the sheriff, but then he's still so optimistic, and that's kind of like the whole vibe that Nottingham struggles with the day to day. I love you Skippy, you're the best. Peter Pan has two really amazing characters that I don't think get enough credit. One is Nana, because She's a dog that actually looks after children. Like the parents aren't even there. It's a real dog that's a babysitter. Hello? And the second is the Crocodile. He has the hands down best villain theme song that's out there. And he's like a villain of a villain. And there's not too many of those in the Disney universe. Moving on to Nigel from Finding Nemo because he's just really great. He's pretty much the one responsible for reuniting Nemo with Marlin, which is why we want to watch Finding Nemo in the first place. Going back to an older film, I particularly love Sergeant Tibbs from 101 Dalmatians. He saves all the puppies by hiding them under the stairs, and it's really cool that a cat is trying to save a bunch of dogs. Like, he doesn't have to do that, but I don't know. I love him. He's great. I think he's very funny, and I like his accent, and Sergeant Tibbs. What is that? Moving on to Emperor's New Groove, which is really underrated, just kind of in general, but Kronk might be the funniest Disney character that they've ever created. He has the best one-liners, he's kind of an idiot, but you love him, he's so good and so well-voiced, he cooks, I don't know, Kronk is like just a big sweetheart and he tries his hardest all the time. Alice in Wonderland may have the most characters of any Disney film, but the doorknob? For when he has the best quote in the movie, which is nothing is impossible, and he's the only character that Alice encounters that tries to help her. Everybody else just gives her the runaround. One of my other favorite characters is Kevin from Up. We all go through a very specific roller coaster of emotions during the intro to Up. I think we can agree on this. And Kevin brings such a fun, comedic lightheartedness to the whole movie. There's something really special and unique about Kevin. And lastly, but definitely not least, I love the Roach from Wally. -E. Okay, he might be a Roach, but he's Wally's -E best friend. And he's actually pretty important because he's really the symbol of what life is left on Earth. Only Disney can make us care about a cockroach. That's my top 10, but there are so many out there. Leave a comment below and let me know who your favorite underrated character is. Hope you guys have a magical rest of your week and I will see you guys soon. Bye.